What's up guys? Eric, am I here with Armor Crate and EXB. Um, it's been a while since I gave this baby a run. Uh, she does have a few changes on her. Uh, first of all, we got some beautiful towers from M2C Racing on here. Huge shout out to uh, Mitch Looper. Uh, beautiful finish. They're nine millimeters thick. Uh, definitely not going to go anywhere. And also, uh, I put in, I had the, uh, the uh, Hobby Star uh, set of 1480 a 4092 in here with the with the max 6 um, I was having some issues with electronics uh, she was acting really glitchy and, uh, and sporadic so I decided to throw in this uh, new spectrum system this is out of like a out of the new uh, infraction and felony um, it's a 2050 kV motor with 150 amp uh, firma ESC uh, this system seems to have loads of power uh, uh, plenty of speed and I will just have to see how the temps go I got a 17 tooth pinion on it right now with these stock uh, a copperhead two tires uh, I may throw some bad lands on it and uh, gear up a little bit just to get a different feel, but we'll, we'll see how it does. Um, and I got the fans on here. I was able to uh, use the hobby, the uh, hobby wing uh, heat sink uh, because the Arma heat sink wouldn't fit with this tower. So and then I just installed the little fan on top of it. So we'll see how long that holds up. And on the back diff here, guys, instead of add, adding the aluminum slip, what I did is I just put one extra large shim behind each planetary. So I got three large and one small, and everything feels really good, butter smooth. So we'll see how it holds up. Uh, it's just kind of a test. Uh, I did one test in the yard, uh, in the street. You know, I ran a whole pack, everything held together just fine. So uh, we'll definitely see how that does out here. But anyway, I'm gonna give this thing a quick rip. See what's up. You guys, she's definitely got plenty of get up and go with the spectrum system. Nice. Oh, that was close. Oh guys, that was almost a hole in one. Oh, that was a hard slap.
All right, guys, that's LVC. She sounded a little bit squeaky. I've got to replace a few bearings. I actually had one lock up on me at the uh, jumping off the big dirt mounds. Um, that's why she sounded kind of rough, but I'm going to go through the truck and probably re uh, replace all the bearings with gems. i got a fresh pack in. Uh, the M2C tires are holding up well, of course. Uh, the whole truck is definitely taking a beating. Uh, the only problem I have had is this upper, the EXP upper suspension block up here. The little screw hole is stripped out for the screw that holds the pin in. So I'm going to switch that out to an M2C and also put the upper pin retainer up here to, to uh, hold that in. So uh, my rear diff uh, mod seems to be holding up with the shims. Uh, I've got about six packs to the truck between yard testing and out bashing and i haven't had any issues with it so far again that's three large and one small per planetary so hopefully that'll that'll hold up but anyway all right guys huge shout out again to uh, mitch from m2c racing and arma for these awesome rigs and we'll uh, see you guys again next time rc dude 801 peace out